Hey guys, what's up? It's Bethany, and today we're going to make banana muffins. But actually, I'm not going to really share the recipe with you because I've never made this recipe, and I don't know if it sucks or not. Hello, this is Future Me, so I forgot to say like and subscribe at the beginning. So I'm inserting this at the beginning, so you know, to like right there, or whatever, right there, right there, I don't know which side. And subscribe and hit the bell notification because your girl's going to be uploading a lot, even if it's stupid stuff like this video. Okay, bye-bye. Go back to the next slide. This isn't a tutorial, so don't get it mixed up. Don't be like, oh my gosh, this is a tutorial. Like, no, it's not a tutorial. It's just me making this and talking to y'all. It's, yeah, you get it? Okay, you get it. Cool. So... These muffins are gluten-free and soy-free, and actually dairy-free too, because um, me, myself, I have a soy intolerance and a gluten intolerance. Um, I measured out too much flour. But yeah, so I don't eat those things ever. I try not to at least. I probably do eat them sometimes. Like the gluten, I'm pretty sure I never eat because I know whenever I eat it. But like soy, I don't know. It's in everything. We put soy in literally everything. So it's like, how the how am I supposed to know that if there's soy in something that I'm eating or not when I go out to eat and stuff? Like at home, yeah, sure, I can figure it out. But like here, definitely not. So yesterday, I quit my job. I don't really want to talk about why I quit my job. Uh, I just wanted to put out there, I'm just going to use the rest of this bag, whatever. Baking is not chemistry, even though it definitely is. But, um, oh yeah, but I quit my job, so, um, there's that. <laughs> Yay for being a non-adult. I am not good at adulting at all. But, um, yeah, I quit my job because I just, I don't know. I don't really, like I said, I don't want to talk about it. But, um, it has me being very introspective about my actions and everything um, and also just like feeling kind of like lost again like I thought kind of I knew what I wanted to do with that job by the way I was a teacher's assistant at a preschool and I really kind of thought like that I was going to want to be a teacher for my life but I don't know, you know, after this experience, I, I don't know if I'm, oh God, that was too much salt. Hold on, I'll be back. But I just don't know if that's what I'm meant to do right now. Um, so, yeah, that's kind of how I feel. It's, it's like, it really sucks in a way because it's like when you think you know, like, you figure something out, and then life just throws you a curveball again, and you realize this isn't going to work out. Um, also, my personality type is a... Hold on, I'm going to check and tell you guys. Um, let's see, where's that? I always forget what it is. I wanted to talk about this, because this has a lot to do... Crap. This has a lot to do with what I was going to talk about. By the way, don't follow my food safety because it's definitely not good. Um, I am an F INFJ, which is an advocate in the Myers-Briggs like personality test. Basically, I don't do well working um, for people. I do best working by myself on creative projects, which is very true for me. Um, I haven't really worked like on creative projects to sell. But I definitely work on creative projects, and that's like my favorite thing to do. That's why I do YouTube, because I like to film and edit. I just feel like it's part of creativeness, creativity. That's what I was really trying to say. Um, but yeah, so I feel like that's, you know, that's part of it for me. It's just like, I guess just knowing that I don't work well in a normal work environment like, I guess it's just hard for me because I know that I'm going to have to be an entrepreneur <laughs> and not work for people. That's just in my cards, on the table. That's what my mom does, and my mom is the same way as me. I actually think we might have close to the same personality type, maybe not the exact same, but, like, pretty close. 
Yeah, late. I mean, I quit Tuesday and today's Thursday. I might have said yesterday, but I quit. Th I quit Tuesday, and I guess I just have been thinking so much lately about it, and like, just I guess just that I want to be happy, and that's really why I quit. Is when I was kept driving to work, I kept thinking to myself, like, if I I told my husband this the other day, like, if I died right now, would I be really happy? Like, would I truly be happy with what I've done? And then the answer was no, because. Like, I'm very, like, creative and adventurous. Like, I want to travel a lot and, like, help people in a different sense. That's very much in my personality type, too. And, um, I just want to, like, help people and just make a difference in this life and in this world. Um, and I guess it's just hard for me because... It's like the constant need, like everybody has the inner need to kind of want to be like everybody else and like fit in the mold that like the world says we're supposed to fit in, you know? But I guess I just need to accept the fact that I am a very creative individual that needs to be free and just like live my life and have fun and just, uh, you know, just does my thing, just has fun and lives my life, basically that's what I'm trying to say. And that leads me to my next point. So I just kind of wanted to tell you guys that if you feel like I do, and there are flies, so if there's like a fly that you see flying around in Texas right now, flies are just really bad. But, um, hold on, I gotta get my coconut oil. Oh, that's hot. Oh, frick. That's so hot. But anyway, if you feel, like, lost right now, and you feel like you're not happy with your job or whatever you're doing, then stop doing it. <laughs> like, life is too short. This might be the only life we ever get. And don't spend it literally miserable. Like, that's so pointless. Like, what is the point then? Why are you here? Like, why are you living your life if you're miserable? That's what I'm trying to say, you know? Like... Don't live your life like that, you crazy person. Freaking go out there and do what you want to do and figure out how to do it. Like right now I'm doing Instacart to make money so I can do what I want to do and work on my business. You know what I mean? So don't be psycho and never do what you really want to do with your life. Like do what makes you happy and passionate don't do stuff because everybody else is doing it. That's crazy. That's cuckoo. Psycho. Psychotic. Like, don't freaking do that. Ah! Yeah, that's psychotic. Don't do that. Don't... Like, with me, I always saw my, my dad be, like, very unhappy with his workplace, but he never quit or did anything about it, and I never felt sorry for him because... He put himself in that mess, like, you know? You know what I mean? So don't be like that. Just go out there and do your thing, girl, or boy, or whoever's watching this, do your thing, okay? I know this got really hard to heart, but I'm, like, a really motivational person. I do not like seeing people unhappy, because I've been unhappy for a very large majority of my life, and I refuse to be like that anymore, so I'm just saying, boo-boo. Go be happy and do what makes you happy, okay? Okay. So, I'm almost done with this recipe. Uh, I think I'm going to cut the video and then just show you guys the finished product. So, I'm about to combine, which actually I won't cut. I'll wait. Um, but I'll show you guys the finished product in a couple minutes. Adding a lot of cinnamon and a lot of nutmeg. But yeah, that's basically what I had to say about that because... I've seen a lot of people in my life extremely unhappy, and it's just not worth it. It's really not. You know? Do whatever is driving you. If it's YouTube, do it. If it's making a business online, doing it. If it's working a 9 to 5, do it. I'm not judging you for doing a 9 to 5, but just some people in the world like me, we're just not meant for that crap, okay? We, we're not meant for that life, okay? Just like some of y'all, y'all aren't meant for this life. Y'all don't want to be out driving around on the road trying to get paid like that, you know? driving everywhere, delivering to people, picking up groceries, like, just so that way you don't have to work for someone. I know a lot of y'all don't want to do that, but it's my business if I want to do it, and it's your business about what you want to do. So you need to just go out and do it, okay, girl? Okay? 
Okay, sis? I believe in you. You got this. Okay, so, I'm about to cut this off to show you guys, like, the finish, the finished product here because I'm nearing 11 minutes and I really don't want this to be, like, long because I'm going to try to cut this and edit it where it's short. Got some walnuts. Cracking my nuts. My nuts! My nuts! So I kind of followed this recipe online, but I actually really didn't. I always do that. I always find a recipe. Then I don't follow it. You guys do want the recipe, like of what I actually did, not the recipe I kind of followed. Let me know, because I'll comment down below or something. But I really just wanted to chat. This was just like, chat with me while I make muffins. And don't judge me, but I'm about to eat raw dough. Mmm. Yeah, that's good. No coconut oil on the side of butter. That's a life hack right there. Okay guys, so this is what they look like. Yum, like, oh, I can't wait till they're baked. So this is before they're baked. I also have like this extra batter here. So I'm gonna put them in mini muffin tins. So, you know, stay tuned for the final result. I never really didn't show you the recipe, but I will show you the final result because I love you. All right, look, they are done. And oh my gosh, they turned out really, really good. Like, yes, yes. So I don't know, let me guys know, would you actually be interested in watching me bake, like actually bake with recipe? These are the minis, I didn't cook them as long, but still very pretty and very delicious. I tried the minis already and they're so good. All right guys, so that is it for baking with me today, basically. Uh, do what you love and what makes you happy and I'll see you next time uh, like and subscribe down below and let me know what you want to see more of I'm just trying to like play around and see what I prefer doing so bye guys <music>